So today we're talking about the remote control block and we're talking about a really cool feature of it. If you've played the Frostbite DLC, then you'll know that it has the capacity to be turned into a little bit of a drone, but we're going to power up this facility. So we'll stick our generators on, turn off the emergency lighting. There we go, that's all firing up and we'll head into the AI lab. So inside here, me, myself, Wizard, the team have, have been looking at the best way that we can extract this strange sort of AI out of these blocks. So when we used to play in Space Engineers, the remote control block comes in a few colours. So green if it's just turned on, red if it's turned off, and you've also got blue if someone's controlling it. But we also have yellow over here. So what does yellow mean? Yellow means it's using like, like a, a sneaky little script of Keen. So if I actually jump on one of these here and I go to the remote control block and I go down here, you'll see it says player vicinity. Okay, what what is what is the player vicinity waypoint? It's quite interesting. We'll, we'll discuss it more as we head into the next room. So as we were playing around, we noticed there was different types of drones and the different drones have slightly different settings depending on how they work. So in this room, we've actually got the drones that we've managed to extract from the Frostbite world. Of course, we flew around, we copied and pasted them, and then we turned off the power. So there is some drones like this little wheelie one over here. Oh, just just to let you know, we are joined by Wizard here. We're going to have a quick scrummy through the drones, have a quick talk about how they work, and then we're actually going to show you how to set them up for yourself. So we've got the basic wheel drone over on this side. Now, this is not actually a drone. It's using the standard remote control and waypoint combination so nothing exciting about that one coming over to the bombing drone here you'll notice it's got a sensor on the top and this is what drops the bombs on you as you fly around that scenario but if we actually power this guy up so the ai with these guys is is pretty damn good they will track down and try to kill people so we've got wizard over if you switch on to an enemy it's currently a friendly so we'll leave the faction for the moment and let's see how quickly that drone can lock on and find you we might have to repaste it back in but that drone is currently in like a search. It's searching the area, looking for hostiles, any sort of enemy that it can track down. There we go. It's spotted Wizard, and it's heading on over. Obviously, the bombing drone spotted you as well, Wizard. So they, bo they are both maneuvering. The bombing drone dropped the bombs on itself. And there we go. It's trying to shoot Wizard. Of course, as he ducks around the terrain, it's going to try to get angles on him. And you can see we're in quite a small facility here. Let's have a quick look around. Oh, it's actually managed to murder him. They're a bit hit and miss, these things. Sometimes they fight, sometimes they don't. I don't know why. So it's tracking you back across. Maybe it has to have a certain sort of level of parameters met. There we go. And what's cool about this is they're actually quite dopey, the way they fire with the gats. Um, so, Wizard, if you um, fall back a little bit and let's let it cut itself a little hole out. So you can easily evade them, but they're fun enough. Oh, look at that. I've got it. I got it. Too late. Ah. <laughs> So there we go. That's that's after you now, I think, Wizard. Let's see. It, may, uh, it could probably do with some more gyro help. Let's let's give it another gyroscope. So w the wheels are currently powered. The, the, we tested this out before, and the wheels won't work. Um, you know, just to drive it casually, it won't stop and start. And yeah, they've got to be set to propulsion override. Yeah, go, go go back to where we were before over here. Follow me, follow me. Come come slap bang here in the middle. Because some, some of them look like they've just given up on life, you know. Some have gone, like, to start a new life somewhere else. I do that, I don't know why. Do you want to put, put, put a few of your Arby's in as well? And they'll chase I me about. I don't know if they'll fly, but... Oh, here's one coming over the ridge. Oh, here's one coming over the ridge. I'll put one in. Well, there's a lot of possibilities for this. You could you could also set it so it follows just you around, so you've built yourself a little mobile storage device. You could, you could do lots of crazy little things. Oh, oh it's coming to go uh -huh. at me. Oh, Ooh. is it too heavy? Is the is it too heavy here? It's trying. Oh, there we go. Yeah, it's having a good go at me, so this one's having, having a focus at me. You put these massive turrets on the side as well to try to do a little bit more work. They, they won't focus on blocks, though, these. They only target players, don't they? Yeah, they all be. Mm -hmm. 
The, uh, the remote control block is for players only. I don't know if you can make them for grids, but for now, players only. So the idea of these is they track you, and then when they've got you still, they fly into you and explode. Oh, that one didn't. <laughs> he's, he's a bit of a friendly. Maybe they design for ground targets, because the, these ones are based off the keen one as well. Oh, here we go. <laughs> oh, there we go. <laughs> so there you go. There we go. A quick a quick look at what you can do with this AI block that Keen have kept in the game. So remember, if you're looking for it, you're looking for a yellow block. You can put it on rovers. You can put it on your own ships. The only issue at the moment is we, we can't get it on large ships, but you probably can with a little bit of uh, maneuvering, so to say. <laughs> oh, hold on. I put the block on the wrong one. <laughs> It's getting a bit, it's getting a bit feisty. This one. Is it? That's funny. <laughs> it's great how you can do this with anything in it. Oh, it's, it's, I, I love how plug and play it is, even though. Oh, oh. oh fuck! It's going backwards. <laughs> <laughs> oh, damn it! <laughs> damn it! Where's Ed? <laughs> <laughs> it's like that speed movie. Uh, I need a control panel. Do you know what you could do? You could set up a bus, right, with the sensors on it, and when it gets to a player and it senses the player, it turns off the wheels, the player gets in, and then it carries on to the next person. It just does its rounds. Oh, oh. <laughs> hmm. We're still going. Look at them turns. Um. Maybe you just um, had the back two wheels with low friction. There we go. You see making, the bus? It's making a wide turn. <laughs> have, you got, have you got your ticket? <laughs> I forgot my ticket. Yeah, because it's going to burst its way over that sand. <laughs> oh, there it is. <laughs> it's just... Does it need more gyroscopes, do you think? Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is this is worrying. Come on, boss. So it, gets, on. it gets to the top of a a peak, spins in the middle. <laughs> this, you know what? It's it's so weird. It's like sentient. It's gonna be a hard one. This I might use a jetpack. <laughs> it's, it's speeding. Oh, I got now. Go, jump. I'm in. I'm in. I'm in. Is it? I'm in. <laughs> Why are you trying to follow me? I'm in the sentient bus. What do I do? Do I take over the sentient bus? Oh! Can do. <laughs> <laughs> do you know what, right? If it wasn't for the remote control block, that thing would have flipped on its roof. Yeah, very true, very true. The gyroscopes are keeping it on track, aren't they? I'm shooting. Oh, Where's yeah. that come from? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, wizard, this thing's, this thing's insane. This little trailer whips about as it goes over the dunes. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Did it survive? Nailed it. Thumbs up to AI, huh? Right, you ready for this? Cause it's going to be coming over this ridge at light, light speed towards us. <laughs> the good <laughs> old boys. <laughs> That's <laughs> awesome. Loving that. Oh, oh, it, it didn't, it didn't make oh, it. It's all right. Just step to the right of it, and it'll uh, correct itself. I think. It's like it looks like a dog that's having a nap. Maybe fly up a bit. Dream help me. it out. It's like your might, your force power in it, you know. <laughs> Just, I might have got the other way. Oh, oh no, here comes the boss! <laughs> 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 oh, right, I've got to wrap that there. What the hell? What? <laughs> oh, this is great to play with. Couldn't have scripted that, could you? No, no. <laughs>